Hello and welcome to Insta Blogs Global Report. This is Sukhmani with fresh updates and more citizen voices from all over the world. Stories for the day are Sheikh Jarrah resident hospitalized after intervening in attempted stabbing by a settler. And Pakhtuns of Pakistan celebrate the recognition of the separate province of Khyber Pakhtun Khwa. Five persons have sustained injuries after Israeli settlers attacked Palestinian residents in Sheikh Jarrah, East Jerusalem. Uh, CJ Wada Buzurek reports this on the story from neighboring Jordan. It seems like things will not settle anytime soon in Sheikh Jarrah of Palestine, as settlers are not sufficing with building new settlements and evicting Palestinian families from their homes in the area, but are also attacking Palestinians who have decided to protest this injustice through demonstrations. This Monday, a group of settlers have attacked demonstrating Palestinians in the area to injure five people, including two men from two families whose houses were slated for demolition and confiscation, as well as three activists from the World Council of churches. Ironically, when Israeli forces arrived to the scene, they decided to arrest protesting Palestinians, one of which was detained for being suspected in the heinous crime of throwing a stone at a settler, while totally ignoring the fact that the problem started when Israelis attacked those protesters. People in Pakistan's northwest frontier province have been rejoicing after Pakistan Parliamentary Committee on Constitutional Reforms agreed to rename the province as Khyber Pakhtunkhwa. As CJ Karim Khan reports on the upbeat mood in the province. This is CJ Karim Khan on Instablocks from Peshawar in Pakistan. For the first time in history, the Pakhtuns of Pakistan are truly celebrating the joy of their identity's recognition. It took decades of perseverance and an unfailing pursuit of identity that finally led to the victory called Khabar Pakhtunkhwa. Starting with the great nationalist and humanist Khan Abdul Ghaffar Khan, through all the political machination, polemical conflicts and terrorism, the Pakhtun nation has been finally led to achieve a goal that they can be proud of under their representative leadership, the Awami National Party. This victory is, however, just a starting point toward a greater provincial autonomy that is indispensable to the prosperity and peace in the Pakhtun inhabited areas, as well as the strength and stability of Pakistan, of whom Pakhtun Khwa will be a vital organ. If you want your voice to be heard by millions, let Instablogs be your choice. You can contact us at cj at instablogs.com. That's all for today's show. We'll be back with fresh updates and more citizen voices. Till then, it's goodbye from the entire team of Global Report.